Hello and welcome back to Subsistence. Oh, I see we have a level 10 chicken over there. I better take care of that. Uh, today is the day we're going to head over and uh, get some pearls. So let's get this sorted quickly. I need to make um, some pickaxes. We've got the diving gear. Just need some pickaxes and uh, we're good to go pretty much. Don't have a lot of room in here, but I do need to eat. So if I take take that with me and we'll cut that into halves and drop that in there that should be good fires are topped up awesome let's quickly make ourselves a pickaxe and uh, we'll head out forgot where i put the feathers then right pickaxe materials do we need one or two i think we'll probably only need one uh let's have a look oh i need four boards wow I forgot we need four boards. Uh, let's make four more boards. And we'll uh, we'll have the materials with us to make a second pickaxe. On the run. And two cordage. Right, there we go. Uh, so we've got some food. And we'll shortly have the materials for the second pickaxe. Diving gear. And I'll change into a summer t-shirt for now. And diving gear. We'll take all of those. Uh, canisters. I think we're going to need a few and uh, we can just potter around and not worry about having to race back. Awesome. Um, let's head down to the lake and hopefully we won't run into any hunters but we'll see how it goes. The eagle has gone. Now I had a comment asking about the difference between revenge only and the other settings for the hunters and um, just to explain uh, the revenge only will the hunters will still attack you if you get too close to them so you have to be careful um, so if I go and attack their base they will revenge attack they will come and attack my base but if I run too close to them and get into their space uh, they will also come and attack I think if I remember correctly I'm sure we'll see an example of that at some point but we'll head down to the lake and uh, go and see how many pearls we can gather and there's a bear there I just wanted to have a look from up here uh, this might be a good place to put a platform to keep an eye on our hunter. Um, I can see they've made some progress. That was not there yesterday. That's quite high up, isn't it? Hmm, okay. Yeah, we'll run down anyway. And um, Yeah, we need a lot of pearls. Probably a dozen or so if we can. Try and make a few solar panels. Um, I'll eat that. And try and get our power situation a bit more stable. We do have quite a bit of biofuel now, but I would like to wean myself off that if we can and try and use the... Uh... Oh! I think we've got rogues somewhere nearby. I don't think that would be... I don't think that would be from over there. Oh yeah, we do. Damn it. Okay. They're over there in case you didn't see. Well, we'll grab this stuff. And we'll continue on down to the lake. Hopefully we've not got too close. And I think we're far enough away from, from the hunter there, so we should be able to sort of sneak past down here. Gotta watch out for um, anybody who might be might be uh, fishing down here, of course. Oh, yeah, look at this. People running along the beach and stuff. That's not for me. That was just because they've been fighting an animal. 
but he does look intimidating. Yeah, they're right on the uh, they're right on the hill there. I'm still struggling with the cold, by the way. So if there's a bit of pause in here and there, that'll be why. Okay, I'm going to hop in here now, and we'll just uh, we'll just dive without the gear for now, and then we'll swap over for the deeper areas in a second. So really, just looking for pearls here. Not seeing anything right now absolutely nothing which is good because you know that's a bit close to those hunters let's get up out of the water and we want to get far enough away from those guys and then we'll dive we'll dive a bit deeper so down by the uh, cave entrance is always a good place and i want to go down into that bay as well Okay, I am going to switch to the diving gear now and we'll head down and see what we can find. Okay, we found a few. We've got six so far. Let me just swap that back over. I'm going to swim around into this um, little bay here and, uh, and then we'll pop the diving gear back on. We've already used one tank, which isn't too bad, but um, you can see they're kind of clustered in areas. So really there's no point in sort of swimming all the way across the bottom with your oxygen uh, because there won't be anything in that little area you need to really go to the next uh, spawn point which I, can't, I, I suppose makes sense oh I see I think another one here 
So we'll grab that without needing the gear and we'll see what else there is around while we're under. Now it's looking a bit empty. Uh, there is, by the look of it, another set of rogues here. Or oh, a rogue has just been here fishing, so... <laughs> um, yeah, there's, there's definitely a rogue there. is definitely something I'd like to see in a new update. Um, the rogues gathering all the materials we do, so I'd like, I would like to see them actually uh, coming out and gathering pearls as well. Oh, I think I see another pearl over here. Might need the diving gear for this one. I want to try and stay away from that bear. Okay, I think, um, honestly, I think that's probably about hit, it for here. There might be some over in that bay down there and definitely some in the little bay just there. But I want to head down this way because uh, we found quite a few pearls down in this area. So I am going to swap ahead of the gear again. Difficult to do on the run. I might even run down the uh, the beach for a bit can get past this wolf because this swimming is quite slow it feels slow actually I bet I uh, I imagine actually the uh, swimming's probably better for this time of year because I think we're still in June and we'd probably be getting warm now yeah this isn't going to take too long I think I will swim We'll have a little look under the water now and then and see if we can see anything. No, like I said, they seem to just be in certain areas. So I think I'm going to head, it's going to be past this rock, just down there in the, uh, in the bay. Yeah, let's run along the, uh, the land a little bit. I do have some lockpicks, so there's a chance we might be able to find a lock crate, which would be lovely. Um, so let's see how that goes. Oh, my fingers are cramped. Hang on a second. Woo. Okay, we've got some ore on the rock there. Let me just have a look the uh, on the hill here. I've got a few bags and stuff. Yeah, let's let's try and get a couple of these bags while we're on the uh, on the land here, and we can take a look at our health as well. We do need a vegetable, which I haven't bought with me. We'll have some water. Maybe we'll get some berries in these bags here. Mm, shotgun shell. Oh, bottle of water. Oh, lovely. Here we go. A strawberry. We'll have that right now. It's going to help a lot. So do we think there are any more strawberries around here? Mm, no. 
there is another ammo bag though. I'll take it while we're here, may as well. And it's nice and quiet. Uh, oh, we've got the stuff to make the second pickaxe, haven't we? We'll do that as well. I saw something I wanted to go back for. Hmm. So probably try and get um, another vegetable and then we'll hop in the water and see what we can find. Should be something around here to eat. There usually is. There's a bear over there. Anything? No. It's all very quiet. Maybe I've missed something. Could have done. Oh, there's a bag right there. Yay! Okay, that'll do. That'll keep us going for a bit. I'm not seeing any lock crates over here, unfortunately, today. I don't want to bring that bear any closer because I've got to jump in the water here. bear and a wolf there and I am hot again so let's jump in and do some more pearl diving and uh, see what we can find. I wonder if the rogues over there have moved. I'm gonna grab these two fibers just because we need quite a few for some fuel bricks again. Right okay right let's go and see what we can get.
Right, we're um, back here again. A bit closer to this side now. And these ones we can definitely get without the diving gear. So let's gather um, a couple of those. We've got a little bit left if we need it. Uh, there's two here for sure. Now I can see there are three here now. And uh, let's, let's try and get as many as we can. Oh god. Need to get a bit shallower here. Okay, that's it. We're out of oxygen. But that's not bad. That's a pretty decent haul. We got 21. It didn't look very promising at the start, but that's much better. Right, I'm just going to check over here because there's usually a carpool up on the beach. And there might be today. And there might also be a chance of uh, a lock crate on the way back that way. Okay, that's looking pretty empty. So I think I'm going to get out of the water here and we'll just take a look um, in this area on the way back to see what we can find, see if we can get a lot crates. Right, good. I'll gather a few more bits and pieces and we do need a couple of chickens as well don't think you'll survive the run back if I if I grab you now but let's have a little look over here how are we doing for food yeah we need another protein bar uh, water's a bit low but we should be a bit should be okay for a bit longer thought that was a berry or something A lot of foliage around now. Makes it very difficult. Oh, some uh, copper on that rock over there. Yeah, there's a wolf there. We're losing the light, so we are going to have to run. But this is good. This is a good angle, I think, to head back towards base. Away from where those rogues were. Keep seeing crates and stuff, so... We'll stop for a few of them. But probably, probably not every one of them. I'll be glad when this uh, when I get over this cold. <laughs> it's almost um, sorted itself out. I think. I think it is a cold. I've had um, a lot of aches and shivers and stuff so I don't think it's allergies okay nothing there stamina is okay there's a box there's another box there some planks that's quite nice I'll leave that zinc I'm not really picking up ore today it was all about the, the pearls to be honest and we have to get home in the dark, I think. Left it a little bit late. Well, we, we're over the hill now. We'll have a little bit more light. Let's just go for it now. Hopefully we don't run into any more rogues along the way. I'll have to avoid animals, I suppose. Whoa. 
Yeah, we're not that far. We're not that far, really. Got that beautiful sunset again. That's the second day we've kind of done this route, isn't it? Yeah, stamina is going down. Let's drink some water. That should help a little bit. Oh yeah, we're going to be stuck out in the in the in the dark. I'm afraid. That's okay. This should be make it interesting. Let's switch to this, and I don't know how much of a battery I have left in this thing. Look at the view, the silhouette there of the tree, amazing. Right, I'm switching this on. So we're at the bend of the um, little river and the cougar is not far from here. And that's what I want to be careful of. Hopefully this uh, flashlight has got enough uh, battery left. I really do need to make myself another flashlight battery. So I think the um, moon light is here around the arch. Um, I want to be careful of that thing on the left. Just let my stamina gen back up again and then we'll run a little bit more. I don't know what you are. You're a wolf. I'm going to run up here. And I want to try and go above um, where any of the hunters might be, but not... I'm going to leave that there. Uh, but not get too close to the cougar, which was up on the left there. So I think we've managed that okay. Oh gosh, that's a bear. Uh, I think we've got enough stamina to run away from that. Oh god, there's also a wolf. I got bit. I think we're okay for stamina though. We're not bleeding. We're not infected, which is lucky. I'm still keeping an eye on that stamina bar. There's our hunter down there. You can see quite clearly the campfire. And uh, we could turn around and shoot this uh, wolf, but we've got enough stamina to outrun. Oh, there's another campfire. Just over there. I wonder if that's a, an actual fixed camp or some rogues. That's an interesting spot. That would be a good place for them, actually. I would not be unhappy if that is where they've decided to set up. I have to go and investigate that. If we can see that from our base, it's probably a hunter camp. Let's have a look from the deck here. No, they're kind of hidden by something. Hmm, interesting. Okay, let's get back inside because I'm going to have to do the fires and I need to do that pretty quick. Uh, we've got enough for one on us and we'll get the other stack. Get the other one made. Let's put some stuff in here. Not a great haul apart from the pearls, which is what we went for, so I'm happy about that. Uh, we'll make one more biofuel. And I think that's us done. Yeah, not a great loot day as such, but we have we have had some great days with our lockpicks recently, so I am not worried. Let's uh, top this fire up. Just about to lose it. Quick, can we make it upstairs before this one goes out? Oh my god, that was so close. Let's put that away. I definitely, definitely have to make a new battery for the shotgun, for sure. Right, we've had a chicken stew and we are completely full now. Love that stuff. Let's split one, ba uh, one battery, one blueberry off, make a blueberry water. And we'll drop that in the oven and those are our um, supplies for when we head down to the cave. And uh, we'll grab this. And do we have any fat? We do. We've got 15. That's full. How is our power? We've not used any today. Not bad. Let's put the 
diving gear away. Got the other set down here, of course. Um, I'm going to put the strength pack away. We'll keep the insect repellent on the extra couple of um, pickaxes. That's good. Oof, okay, we've got water to fill up and refine. I should have got some chickens, but other priorities. That's all ready to go. Let's have a look at our plants up here. Yeah, they need water. Let's do some watering. So, water. Drop the water in here. You need one more. I have to concentrate when I do this. <laughs> I would just poison myself otherwise. Okay, we've got two more here. Let's do these ones around the side. Have to run back and forward, back, back and forth for this one. But it's not too far. There's some carrots on the go there. Okay, that one's good. And we've got some more around here. I don't have a light yet in this area. I should make one. Now, can we reach that? No, definitely not. It's too high. We'll do this one first, just because it's closer. Oh my god, it's so dark. I, I do apologise. <laughs> so very dark. Hopefully you can hear what I'm doing, so... There we go, it's a bit lighter now. A little bit. Okay, last one. And we can sort of head back inside and make some circuit boards, I guess. And start getting the stuff together to make a solar panel. Okay, good. Right, let's turn that light off. Might make a few base lights as well. Clearly we need them. This one's kind of useful there. Right, let's put that on and that on and we need those and what else is it for solar panels um copper circuit boards yeah let's make a, a couple of these let's make six yeah that will be two solar panels hopefully and i'm gonna put the generator on because uh, we've just used up a bunch of our power there. We've got 10 pearls left. Nice, okay, that's good. 169 biofuel. Not sure I need the other generator on, but I am gonna I am gonna run it. I don't want to keep doing that too often because what happens is I'm using the um, biofuel instead of the solar. Uh, power that we've got on the uh, on the roof so but because we've got a lot of crafting to do I do want to get that up as soon as we can what else are we going to need uh, four adhesive one rope and ten scrap ten scrap okay so I'll get 20 scrap two rope and eight adhesive ready that's what we need for two solar panels we don't have the mass for that anyway, but at least we can kind of put it to one side. We need uh, 300 mass. Have I got anything I'd like to recycle? I am looking at the scrap metal. Let's recycle this cloth because we've got no room in here as it is anyway. I am going to make a bit of cordage. I'll need two for the other solar panel, won't I? So, yeah. That's looking good. Um, antlers, we can use to make some more of that. Glass for glass panels. Um, yeah, we don't have a lot of other stuff to possibly recycle. I guess I could do 30 potassium. That's always good for a bit of, uh, bit of mass. There we go. 
Uh, nothing else I want to recycle there for sure. Wait, how are we doing? Look at this, it looks good in its camo. Now I've got some fuel in there, I've got 10 fuel in there. And I noticed I've got some in this workbench, 40 fuel, okay. So I might drop that in there. We've got 50 all together. And I've got my circuit boards. Just need the mass now. I've got both of those running. So let's do some recycling. It's gonna give me 30, another 30. Yikes, okay. But nothing else I can recycle, I don't think. Oh, I do. Let's do these. I don't care about these. I really don't. Nice. We've got enough to do one solar panel so far. Let's get that built. Uh, only 500 ma uh, power, so that's good. Okay, so we need another 150 mass. Um, do I? Do I recycle another bunch of those? Maybe. could do 30 of the weapon parts. We've got a lot of them. Um, could do 50 of these. I really don't use them. Um, let's put those away and those. Maybe do 25 premium feathers maybe <laughs> there are people cringing right now let's do those first then what will they give me another 25 need 150 oh 60 well let's put those in half let's do 15 for now yeah with the rest we can do with this i want 150 I know these are valuable. We'll always get more because we, we farm lot crates, so we never really have a problem with those. Well, not so far. Yeah, we need this power. Both of those are on, that's good. Any fat? Nope. Yeah, we just need 150 and we're good to go. Come on. There we go. Right, we need 500 power to make another one and that's going to leave us quite low. But I think having two solar panels for the end of this day more than makes up for the uh, using all those materials, I think. Get that out of the way because I don't think I'm ever going to use that. We always get our um, medicinal tonic in other crates, um, lock crates, so should be good. Right, let's go put these up on the roof then. We'll leave the generators running. Uh, do we need to eat? We should be good. Um, what have I got quick and easy? I'll do a liver and onions. Is it two onions? It is. Uh, liver and onions, that gives us both. Right, let's see where we can put these because we're running out of space. Uh, it doesn't honestly matter, I guess. They're just sort of above us on the roof. Oh, they've got to be in the bubble. Mind you, we do have the, um, the extender now. Now, will that let me put that there, maybe? I wonder. It looks like it will. So we'll do that. Uh, let's get the other one down. And um, hmm. so we've got three along there. I guess we could start working our way along this way. Don't know where that bubble goes to. I think it will work here. Yeah. Okay. That's good. Well, let's just put that one. They're all going to look a bit odd, but that one there. 
Uh, so yeah, power per second plus 0 0.01. I guess it's not a particularly sunny day. I should probably start, uh, start taking out some chutney with me when I'm running around. And um, we'll make some more um, chicken stew in a little while. I'll do that off camera though. All right, let me just eat this. There we are. Let's go and have a look at the solar panels from outside. Um, how many um, pearls did we end up with? Another 10. That's pretty good. That's pretty decent, I think. Okay, so as far as I can tell, let's have a look how many we've got. Ooh, that's hard to... One, two, three, four. Can't really see. Five, six, and then there's some down this side. Seven, eight. Um, they're all a bit of a mess, aren't they? Nine, ten. We've got ten solar panels there. I probably should move those, but I'm not going to. Let's get up here and have a look from this side. See how it looks. Oh, can I not get up here? Come on. There we go. Yeah, okay. Yeah, ten. We have ten solar panels. That's pretty good. I'm going to make um, a battery before I log off today. And we'll, uh, we'll just continue placing them on the roof. Um, there might be a little bit more room we can put some along here too. Uh, these ones being at an odd angle, I might need to um, might need to relocate those, but it's all good. Um, I wonder how ten solar panels are going to do us. I'm not going to upgrade them. I don't know if it's even worth it. Uh, but we've got uh, five um, wind turbines and ten solar. I wonder how much more we're going to need. But I think that was some good progress today. And I think that's where I'm going to leave this episode. So thank you so much for joining me. Until next time, take care and I'll see you again soon. Bye for now.